It's an honor for me to receive the Citizen Soldier Award because of the other awards and presentations that I've received from Yale, Air Force Academy, West Point. This award is the culmination. This award signifies that I have not only contributed as a civilian, as a lawyer, trial lawyer, but also in the military, serving as a judge advocate in the Air Force Reserve, and above all, serving as a Tuskegee Airman. Pilots of World War II that are now being on it. Now with me, there's something strange about this citizen soldier concept. On December 7th, 1941, Pearl Harbor Day as we all know, the President Roosevelt declared a state of war existing between America and the Empire of Japan. We were on our church, and uh, my mother said to me, you come from two generations of black preachers, so you know where I was gonna be on Sunday morning. She said, boys, America is at war. I want you to serve your country. Can you imagine a black woman saying that all she had were her two sons, that they should serve America, our country, in spite of the treatment we were receiving. So we did. I enlisted in the Army. My brother went into the Marine Corps. He was a Mount Hood Point Marine, and Marines know what that means. So, Citizen Soldier is the best title that any American should want to aspire to. Serving your country in uniform and going back to being a good American citizen that votes. That's it for me.